folks are blessed that work with you, bro. And you said, you know, being honest. I think it's beyond honest, man, because honest is just putting out, you know, what's available and saying, you know, here it is and, you know, so on and so forth. I think it's a higher level of integrity. So the one thing I would advise artists, too, is to do your homework, man, in terms of um, you're not just looking for a deal. You're also looking for people who have good experiences with those people who can talk about it, right, like Byron can. Um, the second thing I would say is, and, and this is just me, and I know, Doc, you're going to say, oh, well, you're an entrepreneur, Trig. I, you know, I, I would say, bro, to the extent that there's publicly available information on any business you go into, you should try to become a student, a student of that business and try to deconstruct right. it and put it on the spreadsheet, right? You can yeah. use Google Sheets. You can get the information. And you should try to lay it out to understand how anyone who across the table from you is looking at that same information so you understand the value exchange. You should understand your value in the deal and the other person's value in the deal because that's the only way you could ever negotiate. That's just that's just rule one on one of negotiations. Yeah. So you should understand that from the onset. So don't go into a deal naked on information. You know what I mean? Know what you know what you're signing. And also know this: if you're going to dumb down a deal, if a label really wants to sign you, they'll they'll let you dumb it down, but then you get less services. 